All the eggs are ready. Ping and ping. Ah. Oh. Hello, guys and girls, and welcome to Parkosaurus from Wash Bear Studios with me, Biffa. Thank you very, very much for joining me. We're going to be diving into a brand new game. If you wish to get hold of this yourself, it's in alpha, as you can see on the screen, but check out the link below to the Steam Workshop. But we are going to dive into a brand new park. So scenarios not available yet, uh, but we are going to jump in with a standard game. So let us have a look at that. We can skip the tutorial and introduction because I have already done that and we are going to go straight into a brand new game. So this is all about having a park filled with dinosaurs. Uh, this is going to be called Biftopia. There we go. And this is our park. So we have some money to spend up there. I'm going to go into free cam mode. There we go. That's the little symbol down the side here. And it gives you the middle mouse button scrolly wheelie looking around like this. Which which is like, it's the look I prefer. So there's all sorts of things we can do here. We can build. We can build paths. We can build fences and doors we can build buildings there's lots more to unlock down here there's trees there's dinosaurs there's terrain manipulation there is all sorts of stuff going on we can nip to town to buy eggs to get meat to get vegetables to get gems to do all sorts of things there we can look at our office to get our staff we can go through the portal to look for dinosaur eggs so we are going to open up the portal there we go, and our scientists are going to go and explore, although I'm not entirely sure we have a scientist yet. Uh, this is the research tree with all the stuff that we can unlock. So much stuff going on there, and these are the hearts that we can spend for dinosaurs, stuff for our dinosaurs. So looking forward to doing that as well. So there we go. Let us dive in by starting. We actually do have somebody here. In the admission booth, although I don't think we can particularly speak to them, they just live there in the wooden booth. But let us start off by making ourselves, here we go, an exhibit. So if we grab the wooden fence, and we're going to start, shall we build, I'll tell you what, let's grab some paths first of all. Standard path, redstone path, it all costs the same, one dollar. Let's go with the redstone path, why not? And we're going to build a little way back up here, so people can walk in. And then if they wish, they can walk off either direction. I'm going to do over the top of that one as well. There we go. And we're going to have our first exhibit is going to be up here. So can we do that? We can pick up that trash stuff in a moment. Oh, there we go. Let's do that. So it's even. Excellent. Uh, keep junk. I think we can actually remove that, can't we? Is there some way to delete it? I think we can just delete it. I don't think we want to actually keep it. So... Destroy, delete. There we go, it's gone. Right, let's grab our fences. We are going to put our first exhibit around here. Um, so if we go, say, I don't know quite how big we're going to need to do this. We're going to make it a nice big size. Can I zoom out a bit? I'm not quite sure whether that's even or not. There we go, excellent. That's our first exhibit. It looks pretty much even, doesn't it, to me? But anyway, uh, we need... To, oh, that isn't going to grow in here. It requires mud. Well, that's okay. So what we can do now is we can set up what we want this area to be like. So if we grab, for instance, our grass, let's get that... I'm assuming if we do that, it's not going to put it where the path is. Oh, it does put it where the path is. That is absolutely perfect. <laughs> <laughs> let's let's get rid of that. There we go. Up to there. Up to there. Up to there. And there. There we go. Because we're going to put some other stuff in here. Good, good, good. So there we go. That is the start of our area. Oh, expedition's arrived. Let's do some digging. Oh, we do have a, uh, me. So we don't have a scientist yet, but we just have me. So what we do in... It's like a little mini game that we can do in here. So, aha, there's something right there. So let's grab that. There we go. We have another Stegosaurus, Stegosaurus footprint. Excellent. And there's another one up here. Oh, there's two here. Let's grab these. So these enable us to go into the shops and sort of spend them to get... Oh, nothing left for that. Okay, we turn home. Before we send them out again, we're actually going to hire uh, another scientist. So if we look at resumes, there we go. We're going to go to scientist so we've got different level scientist one and two level two is good 
because they'll have a bigger area to draw. So we are going to hire you. Yep, there we go. We're going to assign them tasks, which is good. So we'll do that when we get there. Good. There we go. So let's run back into here. Let's look in our backpack. We do actually have one egg, don't we? So he likes grass, which we've got. Biome rainforest and size medium. Uh, and these are the things we picked up. Oh, let's send them off again. There we go. They're going. So let us make sure that this is... Uh, it's actually biome forest at the moment. So we need to change that to rainforest. Here we go. In the terrain menu where we can elevate or flatten the terrain, we can add water as well. Ooh, we have deep water. So we can just sort of draw this in. I'm thinking of drawing in a little bit just in here. And if we watch this, this will start going up. Aha. Uh -huh. So if we connect that together there. We're into rainforest. Excellent. So that is perfect. That is what we want. I might just put a little bit of interesting terrain here. Let's just sort of put this up. A little bit of a hill. What's that there? Elevate. That sort of does one block at a time. Okay, yeah, that's that's good. Little hill over there. Uh, that's a flatten. That's put down. Smart terrain. Yeah, so if we go for this, and we'll just sort of put another little hill up there. Yeah, there we go. That's good. We do need some trees in here, I think. So let's have a look. A tree good for forest, rainforest, and tiger. And I believe all of these are the same. But I want to grab a big tree. So let's pop a big tree there. There we go. Oh, now the biome is tiger. <laughs> it's changed. So we obviously need to put some more water in. And then we can unleash our dinosaur. So let us do a bit of that. You're complaining because of the biome. Oh, I see the ruggedness as also... There we go. Look, it's not how many trees. It's how rugged it is. Uh, okay. Well, let's let's flatten this then. Let's take that height there and flatten that out. Oh, it's almost gone down. Uh, can I just flatten this little bit here? Just want to get it into rainforest. There we go. Oh, expeditions here. Right, you're going to see now how having two scientists... A level two gives you three areas to dig out. So immediately I can see there is one. Aha! There's a skull there, which is good. And there's also something there, but I'm going to use this one. Oh, we've got two things there. Do you know what? I can do that one again. Excellent. So we've got some things we can go and spend in the shops. Momentarily we'll be doing that. Uh, let's use this one. Very good. So as we upgrade and as we get better scientists... Uh, oh, he's got none left. Okay, so we've got 11 left. Let's... Yeah, as we upgrade and get better scientists... Oh, why am I doing that? I'm talking, they're not paying attention to what I'm doing. Um... Oh, we've gained a heart at the end of the day. Heart to reward at the end of the day for every dinosaur that is happy or super happy. Well, we don't actually have any dinosaurs yet. We have no donations at the end of the day because we're not open yet. Um, and also, there's a lot of information you can look here as the game progresses. But we're going to skip to the next day. There we go. And this is a rainforest, so we can stick our dinosaur in here. So let's grab our egg. Let's put that. Can I close that and still have the egg? Yes. Let's pop that in there. Excellent. Now, we want to put in some way to feed the animals. So if we have a look here... Facilities, donation box, outhouse, bench. So that's for the people. That's decorations. We have some lights. Uh, where is the feeder? I know that's here somewhere. Exhibit. Aha, here we go. Small vegetation feeder. That is what I think we're going to need for the Stegosaurus. Let's have a look. Food vegetables. Yep. So we're going to grab that. That is going to go, I would say, over here somewhere. We then also need to hire ourselves, if we go back to our office, uh, somebody to look after the dinosaur. So we've got a veterinarian. So we're going to need one of those. What have we got? A couple of level twos and a level one. So one Artagus. You've got speed, four, three, and 15. You've got 15, four, and five. You're the best one, Cron. What a fantastic name. You're hired. We need a janitor. Are they all? Yep, we've got two level twos. Yeah, you look better to me. We'll have you, Targo, come and get hired. Security, I don't think we're necessarily going to need. Tranquilized dinosaurs that have gotten loose. 
Yeah, we need to buy food as well. Um, yeah, let's get ourselves security. So Juns or Harmony. I'm going to go for speed over personality. Come and join us, Harmony. And I believe that is it. So let's go back into town and quickly order up some food. We want a daily amount of food coming into our shop rather than just buying some. Uh, how much? Oh, hang on. Is our first dinosaur. Oh, look, he's so tiny. Teeny tiny Stegosaurus. Right, how much food does he need? Does it tell us that? Uh, food, vegetables, scariness, aggression. Yeah, it doesn't say. So I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to buy... Um, we're going to buy four of those now. And then we're going to add... Two, three, four to our daily amount. Yeah, I think that's good. So we'll do that. Daily delivery... Emperor Kron cannot access feeder. Oh, I didn't put a fence in, did I? There we go. So we've got our daily delivery. So we'll do that. Uh, let us add a... What's that? That's exhibit door. Yes. So we're going to need one of those. Let's pop that. Let's pop that over here. There we go. So you can now get in. And you, whoever it was that's going <laughs> to fill up this feeder... Oh, the park is closed. But anyway, they are going to take food out of my inventory. I bought four plants. And there we go. Excellent. So they are going to go into there. Cool. Let's have a look. Are they going to go down? Yeah, we've got one left. So we can actually open up our park. If we go here, we can start getting people in. Woohoo! The park is open. Come in and see our one dinosaur in the exhibit. There he is. The teeny tiny dinosaur. This plant is not going to survive. Requires mud. Can I put a piece of mud down right there? Let's have a look at what we've got. Grass, sand, and mud. Oh, hang on a sec. True cater swamp, tundra, or alpine. If I do that, have we messed up what we've got? Still got rainforest. That's good. So you can grow. We also need to add in some privacy tiles, just so the dinosaur's got somewhere to hide if you want. So if we look down the bottom here, we've got employee view, we've got water view, and we've got privacy view. So as you can see, no privacy around here. This bit at the back is private. The reason that is more private is because there's no path around there. If I run a path, let's grab this one. If I run a path up here, there we go. Remember, this was all looking private around the back. Let's close that. Now, this is not looking private around there. So, that's something you want to keep in mind um, when we're making uh, places for our dinosaurs to live. But I'm definitely going to try and help out by making it more private by putting in some of this grass. So, we are going to sort of go like this. Is that junk still there? It is. So we just get rid of that junk. Uh, let's click on that one. Click on that. There we go. Let's clean out that junk. Make it look a lot nicer. Good, good, good. Uh, we can sort of use this other grass as well. It's sort of meant to be for different type biomes. Oh, you can walk on water, can you? Well, flipping heck. You are one clever person. No food to refill the feeder, really. Have you eaten that much already? Let's just grab a load. And then we know we've got some. And that's fine. Right. We also need to put in a building. What a donation box. So I think that's this one here. For people to pay, once they come and have a look, I'm going to put a donation box there. So when they come in and see the dinosaurs and get all excited and happy, there we go, they will then put some money in here for us, which is good. We've got nothing yet, but we will have some more. I'd like to put in... Let's have a look here. So we've got all, all sorts of things here. Oh, wow, look at that. Man, these guys are very excited, aren't they? What's that? Metal arch? Parkosaurus! Oh, wow! Let's put this in. I had not seen that before. Yeah, let's pop that right at the beginning. Nice. Now everybody's leaving. Okay, goodbye. Oh, you're just coming in, but the park's shutting down. I'm liking that. Box tail. We've got hedges. Oh, this is nice. Uh, can I not build at night? Oh, I can't build underneath that arch, which goes there. What else have we got? Wildflowers. Oh, there's so much stuff in here. Potted plants. Info signs. Yeah, so people can come along here and I'll tell you what we want to do. We want to give them somewhere to sit. Somewhere to rest. So if we go like this. 
and have that one there and have that one up there there we go so they can sit and enjoy and look at the dinosaurs and in fact we're going to have another one there and another one there there we go how about that we are going to put an outhouse here somewhere let's maybe run some more paths so we can sort of get the layout of our park set up how we're gonna how we're gonna like it so if we run these along a bit here so we've got this area up oh oh huh suddenly randomly found a skull okay excellent um how do we get rid of these you can do it oh you just got to do it with a remove tool okay i didn't know whether there was let's click on that click on that let's do a bit of clearing up delete excellent so i want to just check on our dinosaur how is it oh look he's sleeping he's sleeping in the oh where's he gone there he is so we can check oh have i woken him up don't wake up go back to sleep lionel oh what a great name so his happiness is 64 uh, needs more rocks suitable for the rainforest to fulfill the biodiversity needs. Okay, hunger's fine and privacy's fine. Uh, it's a herd animal, needs more of a similar species. We can do that. Could use more toys to play with. Well, let's put some rocks in. We can definitely do that. Uh, scenery and quince, daffodil. Oh, wow, there's all sorts of stuff. Well, let's put some of these rocks in there and see if we can get that biodiversity to go up. So maybe let's just add a few in over here. Whoa! Exhibit donations. There we go. People are paying us money. Excellent. We've gained a heart, which is good. Ten reviews for today. Two star, three star. Honestly, I just surf my phone all day. It was clean. It's <laughs> Lionel seen bored. Uh, well, we're working on that. We're working on that. Let's actually have a look. Did I send these guys out again? I didn't. So I want to find another Stegosaurus. So we'll, we'll send those out. Got to keep this going, otherwise you forget. So we have one heart. What do we need? We need five hearts before we can start unlocking other stuff. And science, we have 280. So we don't have enough science yet. Well, that's where some of our buildings will come in. So we'll, we'll get to that. Let's have a look. Where's Lionel? Oh, delivery's arrived. There we go. Our food for the day. Excellent. Uh, dinosaur storage. No, that's fine. We don't have dinosaurs stored. Where's he gone? Is he, like, hiding somewhere? There he is. Let's have a look. So. Uh, the biome exhibit is not rainforest. Oh, is it changed? Why did it change? Oh, because of me doing this over here. Let's see if we can just balance that one again. Uh, we want, yeah, this one here. No, I was right first time. That one there. That one there. Flatten. If we take that. Is that going to get rid of the rocks? No. Interesting. I wonder whether it's because of these. I've done some. Oh, there we go. Look. I did this by mistake. Ah, oh, I see. Right, okay. Let's get that level and make that all nice and flat. Definitely a rainforest. Good. Good, good, good. Sorry, Lionel. I do apologize. So, Lionel, we are going to rename. I am going to rename Lionel. Oh, it's going up. Look. Exhibit's going up. We need more bushes. Let's actually give him some more bushes first. There we go. Uh, rainforest tiger. What is he doing? Is he doing what I think he's doing? Mm, I'm not entirely sure. Let's pop some bushes over here. Um, tundra. Rainforest. Yeah. Oh, what is that? A Thuja bush. Okay. And we'll have one of those. Huh. That looks interesting. Let's pop another one in. Yeah, there we go. That looks uh, less worrying. Let's do that. And then maybe let's have... These work for rainforest as well. Just have like a few of these over here. Excellent. So privacy's going up. I think we're doing okay. I think we're doing okay. Let's click on there. Yep, still definitely rainforest. Add trees to increase your exhibit biodiversity. Yeah, I don't want too many trees. We might start causing problems. Let's have an apple tree. Oh, that's gone up. That has gone up nicely. 
Let's add... Oh, this is nice. I like this. A small little tree. We... Oh, okay. We'll come back to you. And uh, one more. I think it's probably going to take us over. I want to sort of keep the same types of trees. In. Yeah, there we go. We've got it. Excellent. So he should be really pleased with what's going on here now. And hopefully we can get another dinosaur in here soon. Right, we are going to rename this little fella Prazel. There we go. Thank you very much for your support, Prazel, on Patreon. I do very, very much appreciate that. Excellent. There we go. So, what else have we got we can sort of put around here? And then we're going to try... Actually, let's have a look if we can get another dinosaur first. Let's go to eggs. Triceratops. Ah, can we create a Triceratops? So we'd need... We need more items to match the DNA. So we don't actually have... We need an imperfect gem. We need... Ceratopsia skull. So we haven't got that. I mean, no, we haven't. We can't do another dinosaur just yet. So we need to keep waiting for these guys to come back from here and see if we can pick up some more items. There we go. There's a thing. Oh, there's another one. I'm going to do it with that. Ah, oh, okay. Mm, yep, one more. Let's see. Oh, yeah, look at this. This is some coins, I believe. Yes, 500 coins. And there's also something there. Perfect. Another footprint. Oh, and there's also something there. Oh, a bit of a waste of using that one, but never mind. Let's go here. Nothing. Okay, let's randomly pop these in. See what else we can get. We've got two left, so that doesn't really help. We turn home. So, yeah, I think Stegosaurus is the one we want to keep that on. So, yes. Let's do that. Let's send them off again. Oh, there we go. It's night time again. Oh, what's that? Oh, is he even breaking the... <laughs> Looks like he's been trying to break his way out. Which I don't think is a very good idea. But anyway, we need to add some more buildings. Let us do that. So over here, we're going to grab our path key. And actually, before we do that, I'm going to put a building down here. Facilities. Outhouse. That's going to go here. This is for our... There we go. That's for the people coming to visit us. An outhouse. We need that. We're going to pop a bin right next to it. Does that go either way? Guess I've got to delete that first. Delete. Yes, please. We'll delete that. Thank you very much. Uh, we'll get a bin and we're going to pop that there. And probably could do with... Let's have a look. Should we stick a bin there as well just for now? We can move things around if you want. Provide rest. Allow your guests to retain energy and stay in the park longer. Ah, ooh. Gazebo in that area would have been nice, but we'll probably stick something like that by our next exhibit. We'll come back to these things. What I want to get in here is... We've got the balloon, sweet tooth, dino dogs, the research station. That is what we want. So we want to pop one of these in here so i don't think it really matters where this goes we're gonna we're gonna stick it here there we go so we can put our scientists on here to create science credits we can pick them up and plop them on the middle and they will keep working away at doing that which is good so if we can find our scientist scientist there we go so can we pick him up there is an option i think if we click on there there we go that's it so if we pop him on there. There we go. Excellent. So we can change the building colours. So these are the four colours of the building. If we click on one of those, we can then pick a totally different colour. That's how that works. So he's going to keep working along on the science on our research station. Day ending in... Okay, let's end the day now. Might as well. There we go. More money. Excellent. That is what we want. There we go. Good. Thursday of spring. Oh, we have an email. Let's have a look. Keep those pipes clean. Flush 20 toilets from PAX. Uh, yeah, we'll do that. Oh, we've got to do five. It said 20, but apparently five. So, we'll, we'll, you know, we'll do five then. I guess this is filling up. Uh, when to clean? When it's smelly, disgusting, or poop apocalypse. <laughs> Let's go for smelly. Um, yeah, that's a good idea. And that'll sort of keep on top of what's going on. Right, I wanted to put just a couple of plants down here. Let us have a look in here. 
and see what else we've got. This one. There we go. We've got the right one. Potted plant. So we can see a potted plant in each corner there. Uh, what else have we got? Concrete blocks. Increase the decoration. I'm not quite sure what concrete block. Oh, rock piles. Oh, that's interesting. So we could sort of fill in like a gap like this. Could we with a rock pile? Got another expert. Oh, there we go. Just sort of, yeah, just sort of make that look like it should be there. Let's check our expedition. We need, need to get another scientist. We need to start upgrading. Oh, there we go. We've got something here. Thank you. Oh, delivery at the front gate. We'll look at that in a minute. There's another thing. Oh, let's grab those. We need lots of them. There we go. There's another one there. Yep, excellent. Let's have a look over there. Nothing there. Should we go down there? Perfect. One, two. Oh, we've got three left. One. Doesn't really matter. Yep, let's return home. So let's have a quick look into town. Do we have enough now to get what we want? Hmm, there's a whole list of dinosaurs, isn't there? I'm not sure I want stri uh, triceratops, <laughs> triceratops yet. I'd like another Stegosaurus. I'm trying to look in the list here. Minmi, Oviraptor. Oh, wow, there's so many different ones. What's that one there? Gigant... Gigant Spinosaurus. Are you making these names up? Stegosaurus. There we go. Oh, we can do it. We just need a gem. Gems are used to create dino eggs. More can be found in the gem store. Ah. So what have we got? Hats. Gems. Gem. 500. Let's buy two. And then we go back to the dinosaur eggs. We're going to create one. Create two. Look at that. And we can buy hats as well. Uh, we don't have any hats here that we can buy. Which is a shame. Is it, I can't click on these. I think the hats, when you can buy them, pop up in the middle. But we haven't researched any yet. So you're still exploring. So look at our research. 336. So there we go. We can get the box laurel. Box laurel corner. The potted fern. We can get the talon taco shop. Tom's wonton truck, <laughs> fedora, and a hot dog huge. Oh, we're going to go for this one. There we go. Hold it down and unlock. Now we can work our way up for these other ones here. Excellent. So that's what we've unlocked. So let's go back here. I don't believe... Uh, well, let's actually... Let's get our other eggs in here. So we're going to pop one and two down. I don't believe we can put hats on our dinosaurs... Until they've grown to a certain size. Possibly adult. Uh, let's open this up. Oh, I know. We need to go back and buy our hat, don't we? We've unlocked it, but we need to buy it. 1,000 coins! I'm going to buy one, but I'm pretty sure we can't use it just yet. So let's find our dinosaur. There he is. Let's grab that. Can we drop it on him? No. Oh, request tranquilization. Enter dino cam. Oh, there we go. We're just watching what the dinosaur does. <laughs> I like it. Okay, let's come out of dinosaur cam. Yeah, I think I'm pretty sure. I remember in the um, info we were given, too young. There we go. Look, you put the hat there, but you need to be an adult to do it. If we drop it there, it won't go in. Oh, well, we've got the hat from when we need it next. Oh, man, I need to just get myself another scientist to make this go a lot a lot easier. I'm going to do that as soon as we finished here. Whoa, what's that? Oh, is that something new? Flushing the toilet? Good job. I didn't see that there. There we go. We've got that. We've got that. Let's go here. Oh, there's another one up here. One, one. Yep, we've got that one there. Excellent. Nothing there. Oh, one more. Where should we go? Here. And we've only got three left. Three. This is what you could have won. There you go. Return home. Let us get another scientist, if we can. Uh, resumes. Two. Oh, I want a level three. Speed, ability, personality. I don't think that makes any difference at the moment, I'm sure. So we're going to go for you. You're a level two. And you're hires. And then we'll see what happens. The dino book... 
So what have we got? Stegosaurus, Triceratops. We have a reward of a hat. Oh, I see. I didn't need to buy the fedora. We would have got that as a reward. Ah, two Triceratops, two Stegosaurus. We'll get that reward. Right. Well, we're going to work our way through that. The Dinopedia isn't implemented yet. No, I knew that. Hmm. <laughs> Everybody's happy. Everybody's paying us lots of money. Let's actually click on some of our customers and see what we can learn. So, guests. Here we go. Happiness is quite good. Some of these aren't so happy. Our dinosaur is doing okay. Probably could get a bit more happiness. And we have one exhibit, which you know about. We have all These are all the buildings and things we put in. They're all working okay. Yep, and these guys are... Whoa. <laughs> You're really happy, aren't you? Let's give these people some food. So, if we grab our paths, we will go with the standard path and have like a little food court area here. So, what I'm thinking of doing is, let's go out to 30. And we'll do the same here. Yep. Is that the same length? One two three and one one two three and one yes it is so then if we go up to here i'm spitballing this i don't know quite how big it needs to be whoops and if we press alt i think and click it will remove that yes so if i do that there there we go excellent so now we have a little area where we can build some build some things for people so we can have a balloon shop Oh, okay, we've got some stuff to delete. Let us delete this. This. Let's try that again. That and that. Delete. There we go. Perfect. So let's grab a balloon shop. Oh, if we'd gone one up, that would have been in the middle, wouldn't it? Hmm. Oh, I'll tell you what, if we rotate it and put it there. There we go. Balloon shop. Come in, walk past it, buy balloons. That's what we want. Tom's Taco. We've got Sweet Tooth. Talum Taco. And offer us delicious hot dogs. Do you know what? Everybody loves a hot dog. Let's get that. Right, now we've got three scientists. Where's our other scientist? Why did he not show up there? Did I hire somebody that wasn't a scientist? Let's hire you and go back to the portal room. Hmm. That's a bit weird. Oh, there we go. Earn some more money. Excellent. Thank you very much. We'll go to the next day in a moment. Yeah, I'm going to have this one here. That one there. That one there. Oh, yeah, look at that. Some money. I could have done a three down there, but never mind. The last one. Oh, oh look at that. There we go. Two, one. Ah, can't do it. Okay, return home. Open portal for the next day. There we go. Quick sip of tea. Good. So, now, looking at these, I believe we can change the price. We can. We can have normal hot dogs, hot dog big, hot dog huge, and the sauropod hot dog. Let's go hot dog big. So, profits 940, profits 950, profits 930. Let's go the hot dog huge. Let's do that one there. And then the balloon shop. Balloon magic, no magic. Magic dust. No idea what that does. Lower effect guest intrusion. What? <laughs> Not quite sure what that means. We have a problem. One of the employees was messing around in the science lab and the time portal malfunctioned. It opened a portal to future time where the world is only hot dogs. Long story short, we have a surplus of hot dogs and need to sell them to clear out some storage. Yeah, we'll do that. There we go. Sell 15 hot dogs. Excellent. Today, I'm going to halve the price. We're still making profit. We want to sell those hot dogs. Man, we've only got 1,587. Spending so much money. Oh, the eggs are ready. Ping and ping. Oh, you're unhappy. What's the matter? What's wrong? Hunger. There's food there. Are you an adult yet? No, not you. Too young. Not yet. Is it sex mail, food scare, and this aggression? Take down human zero, damage 26. So we've got a male. 
Let's have a look. Oh, we've got green spines. We've got a female. And we've got another male. Oh, look. It's like you're my mummy. Ah, uh, that is nice. They seem to be really pleased. I hope so. Let's just check these out. No, not you. Add more space. Ah, okay. Now we've got more dinosaurs in here. We need to definitely expand and add more space. How's our science going? Oh, we made a lot of money that day. Oh, lack of privacy, lack of food. Let's go to next day. We'll have a look at all those figures another time. There we go. It's Saturday of spring. So we want to make this bigger. Let's do that one there. Ah, oh, there's food. There we go. Plenty of food. Yeah, I think we need to increase our order from the shop now that we have. So we've got four every day. Let's just put it up to eight and see whether that works okay. Yep, there we go. Can we get any more dinosaur eggs? Uh, let's have a look through our list. So the next one we wanted was... Ooh. Oh, if we get a rare gem. Oh, man. We could get a Gigantospinosaurus. What else could we get down here? Let's have a look. Oh, there we go. What's that one? Kentrosaurus. If we get an uncommon gem. Uh, interesting, interesting, interesting. Okay, let's have a quick look at the gem store. Uh, let's go back. Uh, hats. What's this one here? It's closed. We don't know what it is. Gems. So basically, imperfect gems are the only ones that we can buy at the moment. So we obviously need to unlock some different gems, which I'm assuming we would do in here. So we've got the uncommon gem already. Uh, let's us have a look. What have we got? Oh, ice cream fun day. Oh, that sounds nice. Falafel. Increased desire. Funnel cakes. <laughs> okay. Oh, there we go. Rare gem we've got up there. TV we've got over here. What else have we got? Epic. Epic gem. Ooh, radio. Oh, okay, lots of things to unlock. What should we go for next? So we've already got... Oh, well, there we go. Uncommon gem. No, we haven't got that one yet. Oh, man. Let's go back to our gem store. Uncommon gem is going to cost us 1,000. Let's get one. And then let's go to our... There we go. Eggs. And see what we can get. Oh, it's sorted it for us. We can get a Kentrosaurus. Oh, nice. Should we get one of those? Does it give us any information about that? Tile mud, biome tundra, size medium. Oh, let's create one of those. And I tell you what we're going to do is we are going to get those in the next episode tomorrow. So thank you very much for watching. Be sure to hit the big B with the tea stain to subscribe. Any ideas and things like that you want to give us, then... Oh, we're going to get a footprint. Yeah, nice. Then uh, leave that in the comments below as well. And I will see you later on today for the next episode. That's what we're going to do. All right. See you then. Take care. Bye-bye.